Um, so, hi, Ashna. And if I had to, um, you know, pick a particular turning point in my life that was quite recent, it has to be coming here to Australia, uh, to be specific Gold Coast. So, I came here to pursue Bachelor of Physiotherapy at Griffith University, uh, Gold Coast campus, and you know, I can see the difference in myself from, you know, the person I was back in India. I have developed as a person. Um, I got the clean slate that I desperately wanted back in India. I had been struggling immensely with my academics and to a certain extent my social life and just you know everything in general I was not at peace however uh, since I've come here those you know issues have stopped bothering me as much like I have improved academically which is bringing me great mental peace even though the amount of work I'm putting in my studies is a lot. Like, I haven't studied this much in years. And I think uh, I have to be thankful for this new environment that Gold Ghost is giving me. Maybe it's the university, maybe it's the, you know, Gold Ghost thing. But, yeah, it's re- it has really given me the environment to be at peace with myself and my situations in life put the efforts that I always wanted to put in my academics or in myself so yeah I definitely think that coming here was for the better and it was a turning point in my life while doing the interview I realized that asking questions instead of letting the person speak continuously is vital while at the same time staying silent more often than not is imperative for my upcoming portrait assignment I'll ask more questions focus on the sounds around me in the room and have multiple cameras set up the advice of how to frame your questions made me reconsider my structure after reading Ravage's text as I saw how they can potentially be misinterpreted it stood out to me because I analyzed the idea of better manipulating someone on camera to sort creative needs the concept of what Fox Pops interviews emphasize to me how you can depict an opinion's antithesis in a diverse and interesting way, portraying the voice of the people. Mm-hmm.